That's right, dudes. Jukebox mode is here from the IRK. Brand new free application feature available on their platform. It's in beta, but it's looking pretty good for beta so far. Time to party on. All right, to get this set up, you want to have your iArcade arcade machine turned off. Go ahead and navigate to the iArcade app on your phone, and you'll notice under Recent Games, you got a brand new thing here called iArcade Jukebox Mode that's in beta, and it's free for all users because this was something that they told us during the Kickstarter was a feature that they would give us anyway, even though a Kickstarter goal wasn't met. At this point, you're going to fire up your iArcade arcade machine, and it'll start downloading that Jukebox Mode beta application. Oh, and don't worry, once we get it connected, I'll switch to the HDMI capture card. Once you get fired up on the arcade machine, the application, after it's installed, it's going to say, wait for Bluetooth pairing. At this point, on your cell phone or media device, you're going to head over, and most likely you're probably going to want to use your cell phone for this, head over to your Bluetooth settings, and you'll see underneath available, if you have your Bluetooth scanning for devices, you will see iArcade. So for instance, there it is right there, available devices, iArcade. I'm going to click on that, and I'm going to let it pair to my arcade machine. Very simple, simple process. What's really cool is you do all this from the app on the phone as well as the actual game app. You don't need to hop into the iArcade settings menu where you would Bluetooth uh, headsets or things of that nature. It's all done through this actual application. It's connected. Now it's time to party like it's 1984. You also notice on the initial here, although there's different themes to this application, which we'll show you, the record wheel is going to start spinning and it's now connected. All right, switching over to the capture card here so you guys get a better view of what's going on. This, of course, is the initial theme. There's multiple themes on here, and I'm assuming more themes will be coming down the road. It's a very easy to follow, figure out user navigation. If you're going to be blaring music out of the speakers of the iArcade, make sure your phone volume is turned all the way up. That way you can get maximum volume off of the speakers that it's paired to, which is the iArcade speakers. And you can use the left and right joystick button in order to turn the volume up and down. And once you fire up the music, you'll get some little animated effects with these speakers uh, kind of bumping in the background here as we navigate through the different features. So we're going to change the skin over to the uh, dot matrix one. This is kind of more of a retro bit isk uh, type looking theme. And of course, we're going to have our bouncing IRK logo. We're going to have uh, we also have the actual background image set to an animated underwater image with all the different kinds of blinking lights and things as your music's playing. This one actually is kind of cool in my opinion. I like the way this looks. And if you don't like that, you can go ahead and switch it. They have a couple of different options on here for your background image. And of course, you if you wanted to make this go full screen, you can just hit the coin button and it'll take up the entire screen. I do also like the animated uh, firework background that you can pick as well. And if you're not happy with the dot matrix one, you can go with this one right here. This is the third option available. This one looks pretty cool as a skin as well. And again, you could hide it by, you know, clicking on the coin button and going from full screen back to this in case you want to adjust all your settings and things like that. Here we are at full screen. Looks pretty cool. Add some lights in your uh, arcade. You have some sound effect lights that bump when music's playing. It's just really going to set things off. Neat little feature here. Now, depending on the type of music you like to play, I love the fact that they added a graphic equalizer on here. All you have to do is hit the equalizer button and then a little green dot appears and you can manually navigate and toggle all of the different audio settings to your wish. But there is a nice little feature on here where they have some preset settings for you, depending on your favorite genre of music or the genre of music that you're playing at this time. As you can see, you can go ahead and uh, pick whichever one you want. You want to rock out? Here's the best recommended settings for rock. You want to switch to a, a tr electronic, pop music, etc. And it'll really help uh, take advantage of those 100 watt speakers included on the iArcade. Yes, to avoid any kind of copyright claim or copyright strike on my channel, I got to use those cheesy copyright free music. Although there is a lot of really good copyright free tracks out there if you dig and find them but as you can see here this is pretty cool connect your phone play your spotify your pandora any of your music audio uh playing apps on your iArcade. you could even connect this and use it as audio for netflix and 
things of that nature. This opens up another world of possibilities with the iArcade enabling some of these Bluetooth features. Personally, I think this is a super cool addition to the iArcade platform. Uh, we've heard a lot of their owners have been wanting this. It was told to us during the Kickstarter. And even though that Kickstarter goal wasn't met, iArcade said they were going to deliver it anyway. And here it is. It's fun. Get your arcade rocking, especially if you own multiple devices. Have your iArcade blast in the music. Take advantage of those speakers. And overall, the beta interface works pretty well. I hope they add more skins more themes and things like that in the future. and and But I want to know what you guys think. Let me know your honest opinions and comments below. I think this is a win for iArcade, but give me your honest thoughts. If you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up on the way out. Party on, dudes. And thank you for subscribing.